There we go. Hopefully it's everything is good. Yeah, so I think it's all good. Perfect. All right. Uh, let me just make sure that it's all good. That's what that looks fine to me. I'm gonna need to figure out some way to pull the stream up. But anyways, guys, welcome to today's live stream and stuff. Um, I just want to say thank you all for being here. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you very much. But today's episode, I decided to um, do like a little live stream. So if you're watching this on YouTube, it's going to be a lot longer than a previous. And it looks like we got a new letter for today. Um, we're playing a little late, so there's that. We have the AJ Show. Okay, so this is the people that uh, Tom Nook mentioned before about our house and stuff here. Welcome to the Happy Home Academy. All members can use our Happy Home Showcase. Please be sure to visit us when you get the chance at any point. All right, so I actually don't really care that much for for joining them, but it's whatever. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of all these letters and stuff because I take up a lot of space if you're not careful. Like, they'll take up a whole lot. All right, also, somebody new moved into the town today. Um, let's see what they're called. I, I forgot. Um, yeah, that deer, deer that's, a, that's such a weird name. We were trying to figure it out before, and we could not figure it out. Now, let's um, check this out really quick. See if the money rock is next to our house again today. And we're not going to be as lucky as we were. Um, oh, there's a balloon here. Oh, what's that noise? We need a slingshot so bad. I wonder if Tom Nook has one in his store right now. Hey, there's a thing here. And is this potentially a fossil? Let's go ahead and dig it up. And there we go. First fossil for today, boys. Let's go ahead and go over to the chat and see if anybody's in the chat. Uh, Rolf, Ruffle, 89,000, dude. Thank you for joining the stream. I'm actually going to pop out this uh, stream chat so I can uh, read it. I'll put it over here somewhere. All right. <clears throat> there we go. All right. Let's get this going, boys. Okay. So that's our first fossil for today. Our first fossil. Let's go ahead and talk to Deirdre or whatever his name is and see what it says. Hey, Cole. Aw, oh, I'm impressed. I'm see that you'll survive in that case. So what's up? Uh, let's talk, dude. I've been having trouble catching an eel lately. Uh, maybe it's me. Maybe I think the fishing skills are rusty. Rusty. Uh, we've, we've caught two eels, so we can probably find another one. All right, Ricky. We will find you an ill, hopefully. We can find you one, I don't know. Um, let me put this over here. There we go. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and uh, keep looking around. We gotta search everything. And like we gotta make our town look perfect, guys. My goal is to get all of the gold items and stuff and have our house fully upgraded by the time that the new Animal Crossing game comes out. So we'll have all the experience that we need. We're doing pretty good so far. I think we're doing pretty well. I also wanna have a large amount of the stuff donated to the museum. What in the world was that? This rock broke apart and something was inside of it. I don't know what this is. An emerald. I don't know what we use those for. Can we donate them to the museum or something? I'll take it to the museum and see if we can donate it there. Oh yeah, you're still looking for that eel. Sorry, I didn't mean to talk to you. Well, let's go see if we can meet the new person in town. See what they say. Oh, yes. It's, uh... It's not fluffy, it's flurry. I'm about that. Yeah, flurry, yes. Hey there, ready for another great day? Uh, what's in your mind? I want to chat. Uh, there's nothing quite like eating a pear from pewter, wouldn't you say? I absolutely love them, you know what? Just talking about them has me started craving. Um, let's go see. She asked for a pear yesterday, too, so we'll see if we can find a pear. If we can, we will bring it to you. All right, ma'am? All right. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, there's some weeds. No weeds in my town. Maybe we can find a four-leaf clover. Nope, no four-leaf clover today. Let's continue on our journey, then. Searching the town for for some fish and stuff every time I've seen like a really really big fish It always gets away every single time Every single time and if you guys want to talk in the chat, that's fine There are actually some pairs right here, but first uh, let's see if this is the money rock All right, so you can use that button to do that Nope. Ninja <laughs> Snake hey cool well, I'll dismiss one of, uh, whatever. Um, let's see where we go. Wanna chat? Yeah. An important package from Flurry got delivered to my house on mistake. Do you have a minute? Actually, I'm actually just going right over to her, so. Give me the package. I'll take that over to her. I'll also give her a pair. So, they're starting to give us a lot. A lot, a lot of, um, things to do. Alright. So, we're making pretty good friends, and I think everyone's gonna be happy. I just don't want anybody to move, you know? All right, Flurry, let's get this package over to you. We make sure we don't scare away any... Actually, she's right here. Awesome. All right. Uh, it's so nice outside today. It kind of makes me feel like sunbathing. It's it's like 7 p.m., so I don't know. 
Um, here you go. Here's a pair. Okay, we're gonna complete two challenges for her in one go here. There's a nice little pair. Nice little native pair for you. Alright. And she hit that up really quick. Alright, that really hit the spot. Here. To express my thanks, please have a modern wall. Oh, yes, modern walls are always nice. We're always looking for good stuff to make our house better. Or things that we can just sell to get more money for our, for whatever. We've also got a package for you, though. Um, delivery. Now, what could this be? Yeah, I don't know what it is. It said Snake sent it over. He said it was his, or it delivered to his house. I don't know. Really? A package for me delivered to Snake's house? What could it be? And there we go. It's some furniture. Your director's chair. That sounds like a pretty cool chair, actually. Thank you so much for the delivery. Can I interest you in this? Please take it. It's the least I can do. Hey, a free t-shirt. What is that going to be? It's a fall leaf t-shirt. I hope you really like it. Oh, that'll be good for... We just got bit by a bug. Stupid mosquitoes. All right. Let's go ahead and check this shirt out. All right, we'll go ahead and wear it now. I like how it's long sleeve. It looks nice. All right, so let's go check on Deirdre. Wait. Oh, uh, she's sad. What's up, Barbara? What's wrong? If you're trying to cheer me up, it's not working. I need a little bit of alone time. All right. We'll let you, we'll let you chill out on your own for a little bit. But let's check out our new villager. This tree is growing a little bit every day. Hey, what do we have here? What do we have here, boys? A tent in the middle. Ryan says hi. Your videos are great, dude. Ryan, thank you. Thank you for doing the stream. Actually, we have two, three paintings here. Let's see if we can buy these. Or can we only buy one at a time? I think that's how it works at Red's Gallery. This is your one only chance to buy a piece of famous art. All right. All right. Don't be shy. Look around all you want. Hopefully, one of these is not uh, fake. I want to buy that that Japanese one over there. I want to buy this one, please. All right. Um. All right. Can we buy them all? Three thousand bells. That ain't bad. I'll take it. All right. All right. Can we buy more than one thing? Let's see if we can buy multiples, because we need to get, um, we need to get as many as we can for the, okay, so we can only buy one per customer, so, we bought that painting, so hopefully it's not a fake, so I know in previous Animal Crossing games, this guy always sells, like, fake paintings, alright, so, he'll send the purchase off to you as soon as the exhibition is over, and that's pretty nice of him to do, I guess, <clears throat> but we need to get some paintings for the museum started, and hopefully that's not a fake one, because that would, that would suck. And there's a fish. It's not an eel, though. We're looking for an eel, boys. I think they're usually in these ponds, anyways. Or over. I think this is Deirdre's house right here, actually. Is this Deirdre's house? Dar Dar I don't know how to pronounce it. Deirdre. 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 I'm just gonna say Deirdre. That's what I like to say. So that's what I call it. Okay, Deirdre. Let's see what you've got in here, my dude. What kind of house is this? Oh, he's Deirdre. I'm gonna call him Deirdre because he's literally a deer. Oh, please. It's a girl. Okay, and you are... Oh, wow. I've heard about you, Cole. You're one of the reasons I moved here. Yeah, I heard you were making Pewter a place to be. I pretty much had to move here because of what people were saying about your potential. Hey, that's pretty nice. I love this, like, uh, wallpaper. It's sick. It is actually a really cool wallpaper. I like it a lot. Alright, so is there anybody in the chat? Anybody in the chat? Alright. So we met the new person, and we've uncovered a fossil and stuff. But I don't want to turn any fossils in until I've made sure that there are no other dig sites. We need to explore this area up here someday, but not today right now. Maybe later today. Um, but I just want to do some other stuff right now. And first, find that money rock and pick up this weed, because we got to have a nice-looking town, you know. We've got to have a nice-looking town. This like, little area here has like a lot of houses, so they're really booming over here. Okay, is this the money rock? Not the money rock. All right, this is the money rock here, boys. Here we go. It is the money rock. It's the money rock, boys. We gotta get it. We gotta get it. And there we go. One day we'll get all the, the things. I'm going too slow though. You gotta go a little bit faster than that. But I don't want to miss the rock because then you will miss a lot of the money. But that's gonna be today's payment. That's actually it's actually quite a bit of money, so. I'm really glad that we didn't do this every single day. It's like nearly ten ten thousand dollars every day. All right, there we go. Also, there's a geo. I actually have one more piece there. I didn't see that. One more, one hundred more. 
All right, we've got this geode to check out. I'm gonna take it to the museum later, or maybe not. I don't know. Uh, there's two dig spots here. Is one of them fake? No, nope, they're both real dig spots. I'll check them out here. There's a fossil number two today. Fossil number two. So we're starting to get ahead on our fossils now. I thought it was gonna take a long time to get some dinosaur parts, uh, but we're we're getting a lot of them, like three a day. So it's, I'm pretty impressed with that. I don't know how many pieces there are. We're going to start getting duplicates eventually, though. That's going to suck. I'll hit this rock. Sometimes, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Those little bugs in the rock sometimes. It's a pill bug or something like that? Yeah, so the pill bugs can be found in the rocks. That's, uh, that's like the only rock. So, I wonder how often you can find those fake rocks that we just found today. And I wonder how often we can find uh, whatever. I basically caught that. Is this a long head locust? Yeah, it's a long locust. We already caught one of these. Alright, but this is this the pitfall? Nope. Is this the last fossil of the day? Is this the last fossil of the day? I believe so, boys. I believe so. Okay. Go ahead, bury that bad boy. And we have a total of four fossils. All right, let's go check in really quick with, uh, okay, Bar is doing better now. All right, well, hello again. Aren't you busy, Cole? What would you like to talk about? I, wanna, I just want to chat. What's up? So I'd really like to give you an elephant tree, Cole. I actually would enjoy it. Oh, an elephant tea. That was an elephant tree. I was like, that sounds cool. Thanks for accepting my gift. I just hate to throw things away. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right, let's check that one out. An elephant tea. I'll wear that for now. That fall one is cool, but it's for the fall, obviously. So you guys say it for the fall. All right, let's go ahead and talk to uh, what's her name about our stuff here. All right, if we go back here, we can see what the, how like the progress on the forms are going. All right, ah, oh, Mayor, you came at a great time. Your town development permit is here and you can finally get to work. As mayor, you have two primary ways to influence the growth of Pewter City. The first is ordinances. By enacting ordinances, you can change the way Pewter is run. Of course, you just you can't just enact any old ordinance you feel like enacting. That would make you a dictator. Instead, you're able to choose an ordinance out of list provided to you. So try to choose ordinances that match up with the lifestyles and needs of the residents. The second way to exercise your mayoral power is by starting a public works project. A public works project adds buildings and features to Pewter. I've already taken the liberty of putting together a list of requests from town and citizens. If there's a request that really speaks to you, please select it from the down development thing. Okay. Okay. So we should sit in the chair whenever we want to do stuff. And I'm assuming we can only build one thing at a time, which is cool. Okay. Uh, let's check out the ordinances here. Okay, let's work on ordinances. At present, there are no ordinances in effect. A fee of 20,000 bells. Uh, I don't have 20,000. Okay. Okay, so we can't do ordinances, but we can start a public works product, and we can go get 20,000 and see what an ordinance is, because they might be helpful. First, choose a product you would like to work on from the list of requests citizens have made. Once we chose a product, we will go search for a place to build it. Once we found a spot for it, we'll need to raise the construction funds by asking for donations. Then after we've collected enough donations to fully fund the product, the structure will be built. Please keep in mind that we only have the resources to work on one public works project at a time. Well then, let's dive right in. Here are the current requests from the townspeople. Alright, so they either want a bridge, a suspension bridge, a bench, a water well, a fountain, campsite, a fence, fire hydrant, custom. So we can build any of these. Um, I'm thinking about building a new bridge, boys. Yeah, a bridge is probably the best thing we can build. Um, so let's go look for this. Let's go find a good spot because I need to like a better place to go from my house um, over. Okay, and I don't want to make like a, I think you can make three bridges. I guess you can make another wooden one. But first, let's find a good place to put this bridge. Okay, 
I want to put it over next to my house for sure. Alrighty then. I'm thinking about like right here. Okay. Uh, yeah. What do you think? All right. So we can see an idea of what it's gonna look like right here. All right, I think that'd be perfect right there. Yep. Yeah, let's put it there. All right, perfect. That's gonna be perfect. We can put a bridge there, and we'll finally be able to not have to go all the way around when we're doing stuff. Okay, to help us get donations to find the cobblestone bridge, is our helpful town guy, Roid, dude. He's basically like a donations box. I'm sure I mentioned it to you before, but all the construction costs for projects and pewter are covered entirely by donations or whatever. Okay. Alright, so this is where the bridge is going to be. We can have total three bridges in the town. Awesome. Alright. Alright, so we can officially build a bridge here. That's pretty sick. I'm gonna catch this big old fish right now. Catch this big old fish. I got a good feeling about this fish, boys. Let's get it, let's get it. Bad gummit, I get so nervous at fishing, dude. Does anybody else get that nervous? I don't know, I just get really nervous when, I, when it comes to fishing like that. I don't know if we're gonna be able to find a uh, an eel before the night's over. There's another big one. I think these are usually just bass. Usually anything this big is usually just a bass. Okay, one. Okay, I almost let him get away, but I got it. Kachow, sick. This is a weird fish, but dudes, <laughs> it's a weird fish. It's not even a fish. Hey, Fluff. Uh, you know what? I always call you Cole. What do you feel about trying a new nickname? Uh, like what? Um, how about Cupcake? Uh, I guess. Might as well. Come on, whatever you want to call me. So glad you like it. Then it's settled. From now on, I'll call you Cupcake. Okay. Alright, Cupcake it is. Alright, so I think in today's episode, oh yeah, my Milo Tech flag, I almost forgot about that thing. It looks beautiful. Alright, so I think uh, I'm going to be donating everything I can to the museum right now. And then we're going to check Tom Nook's store to see what he's selling. And I don't know what else we're going to do. We're going to do some different stuff, whatever we can do. Uh, up there is the HH people. I ain't going up there, boys. I ain't going up that way. Let's go ahead and donate to the museum over here. I don't know if we can donate the emerald or what we can even do with that emerald. I'm gonna have to like Google something on that one. All right, blathers. All right, here we go. Ha, welcome, welcome, welcome. Let me scoot up to my screen a little bit here. Okay, there we go. All right, how many be of service? Uh, we have uh, four fossils. I think it's four fossils. I don't know. Let me check here. I wish you could select multiple. Oh, you can. You can. We have four fossils to assess. All right, let's check them out. More than one, I see. I thought you could only do one at a time. That's so much better. Okay, let's know that's not part of the museum yet. It's really most stunning. I believe you have the natural talent for fossils. Okay. All right. All right, so we can. Can we donate more than one item? Let's see if we donate more than one item. Okay, so two of these were already... We've already given them. The saber tooth, the saber tooth will be completed. Yes, yeah, so we can donate more than one item. I've been doing every single item one at a time. This is a revolution. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Okay. All right. So that means that the we got two of the same fossil, whatever they are. Let's check them out and see what they are. Uh, we have Ichio skull, Ichthyo skull, and saber tooth skull. And that means we, we literally could have had the full saber tooth out there if I would have kept it. I could have kept it for myself, but I think it would look better in a museum. Um, let's go see if it, what it looks like. We should have a few things. We have a raptor torso here. That's something that I donated a little bit ago in the last few videos. So I don't, I don't know if these dinosaurs are like separated by like what era they were in or something like that. But let's go look at the, the other one. 
Alright, here's the... Is this the Ichthyo thing? Iguanodon. That's the Iguanodon. We have a tail here. And a neck. We're starting to get some dinosaur stuff for sure. And... Oh, apples here. Woohoo, Cole! I was out for a walk too, and so what's going on? What's the latest, my dude? I wish I could travel back in time to visit the dinosaurs. I would teach them all about fashion. Alright, I guess if that's what you want to do, you can do that. Shout out to you guys that are watching on YouTube right now. If you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe if you want to. Oh, I like this dinosaur. It's like a water one. And then we have the saber tooth here. The entire thing is fully completed. That's our first fully complete dinosaur. I like that a lot. All right, so yeah, 80% or like 80 to 90% of my viewers are not even subscribed. So if you're enjoying the videos, then please subscribe to the channel. All right, boys. Um, we have a few things I'm going to be selling. I'm not going to be selling my fall tee for sure. I'm going to be selling that, um, that other t-shirt that I was wearing. I don't know what it's called. Um, purple plaid or something like that. All right, but there's that. We donated the pill bug too, but I don't like going for the bug exhibit that much. And we should have a painting coming in tomorrow, so... Um, tomorrow we'll have a new painting for the museum, which is awesome. Can we actually fish here? Oh, we can. I wonder if you can actually catch anything right there. Okay. Uh, let's go check some stuff out. I don't know what time the Nookling Junction closes and opens, but it is, I think it's almost 7 o'clock. Yeah, it's like 5 till. I wonder if they close at 7. A spaceship and a scarecrow. Okay, so we couldn't donate the emerald. I just noticed that. Um, let's see how much he will, he will buy that emerald for here. We have this emerald here. We will like to sell this emerald. 1,600 bells. Alright, now let's go see how much we can sell it for at that retail place. That place is like crazy. Because um, their prices are like way better than Tom Nook's. They'll probably give like almost 3,000 bells for this thing. Alright. So what's more important, guys? Paying off our debt to get a bigger house or um, doing the other thing. What is it? Oh yeah, the bridge. I'm thinking that the bridge is the most important thing to focus on right now. So I'm not gonna worry about my house until after we've completed the first, um, the work in the town. Because I think it's more important to keep our villagers happy. We don't need a huge house. It's not about us. Okay, I have a few things that I wanna sell. Um, I have this emerald. Will you guys take it off my hands? Um, confirm. 2,000. Alright, um, we'll just sell everything in bulk. Uh, also the dinosaurs stuff. I don't really want the dinosaurs that much. So we'll go ahead and sell the dinosaurs. I want to sell the dinosaur. I will sell these pears. This old tire. Not the fall leaf shirt. The dinosaur. The picnic tea. The long locust. Bamboo flooring and modern wall. I'll keep the modern wall because I don't know what it looks like. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and sell this stuff. Hopefully we can get a little bit of, little bit of money for this. And we should get... 7,000 bells. That's pretty good. And now we can go talk to uh, Isabel and see what an ordinance is. Because I don't really know what they are. I don't really know what they are. Um, they'll probably increase. Increase how like, the village works and stuff. But hopefully increase it for the best, you know? Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Time for our mayoral duties. Our mayoral duties. Okay. Hi, Mayor Cole. Is there something I can help you with? Uh, let's check out some ordinances. I finally have enough money. Okay. To enact an ordinance, a processing fee of 20000 is required. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead. Okay. Now then, what kind of town would you like to Peter to become? Uh, a beautiful town, an early bird town, a night owl. A wealthy town would be nice, wouldn't it? Um, what are the differences? I'm gonna have to get my phone or something and Google this, so hold on, guys. All right, I'm back. And uh, let's um, let me check my phone really quick and Google what these different ordinances are. Um, oops. Animal Crossing New Leaf ordinances. Let's check it out. All right. A town ordinance is a rule that changes certain things about your town. Okay. Okay. 
It says here we have different things. The beautiful town. It says cockroaches never appear in your house, even if you don't play for a while. Weeds are rare. Flowers don't wilt. Villagers water and plant more flowers. Awesome. Tom traveling does not cause weeds or other environmental problems. Early bird town. Shops open three hours earlier. Villagers get up uh, for the day and go to bed three hours earlier. Nightlife town. Shops close three hours later. I think I like that one because then we can play later. Um, all right. And Bell Boom town. I guess it's the wealthy town. Both buying and selling prices increase. Um, there are two high price items at retail each day instead of one. Um, you get more medals and island tours. I'm gonna go with the nightlife one probably. That sounds like the best one for me because then, like, if I'm on here late, like right now. Okay. Exactly. We need a nightlife town. Let's sign the Night Owl Ordinance into law. There we go. Then it's official. The ordinance will go into effect tomorrow morning. Alright. So, there we go. We've done a public works product. We did an ordinance. And that's that's all the mayor stuff we're going to be doing for today. That ordinance will go into effect tomorrow. So, we have limited time with the shops right now. I don't really know. I don't really know. <clears throat> Let me check. I'm going to also Google like what time the shops close. Okay, it is now seven o'clock in the game. All right. <clears throat> it says, all right, so the Nookling store is open till 10 p.m. and retail is open till 11 p.m. I don't, I didn't know they stood up that late, but that's pretty late to be open. I remember in the other games, like they went to, they like closed at like six or something like that. Like it was so early. Yeah, they're still open. All right, so um, what do we have? How much space do we have in our inventory? Let's head over to our house really quick and uh, put some stuff up. And I think we're gonna be fishing today. I think today is going to be a fishing day. I'll keep my shovel and net and stuff out because you never know when you need a shovel and net. Um, but we're going to be going to the ocean today for the first time in fishing. We've never really done that before, so it's going to be a big difference, dude. It's going to be a lot of new stuff to donate to the... Oh, there's a bug flying around me. A lot of new stuff to donate to the uh, museum today, so let's get over to the house. And is this rock, is this rock always here? You gotta be suspicious. These rocks can come in and they be fake rocks. So you gotta be careful. Alright. I can't wait for that bridge to be there. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be a sick old bridge, boys. Alright, let me move in closer here. So, it said that, um... Let me check that again. Alright, it's really quiet in here. I need some like, music and stuff. You can also turn on the lights. I didn't even know the lights were off. Alright, so let's check our new wallpaper here. Hang on the wall. I like that one pretty good. We'll just leave that on there for now. All right, we need a new closet. This one is pretty bad. Um, yeah, and that's like all the stuff right there. Let me have some more space. But I like our house. We don't really have anywhere to sit or lay down or anything, but it's pretty good. I'll leave the light on for now. All right. Let me look at those shop hours again. I'm gonna go ahead and like screenshot that just to make sure. All right, um, it says here that once the Night Owl thing goes into effect tomorrow, that the Nookling store stays open until midnight, retail stays open until 2 a.m., Able Sisters till midnight, Garden Store, then we have all other stores that we don't even have in our town yet. Um, but Nook's Homes is going to close, they close at 8, so they close in an hour. Um, but I doubt we'll get enough money in an hour to pay off our debt for our house. The main thing I want to work on is getting money, and I want to see if in this episode we can pay off this bridge. I think that would be impressive. Alright, so we have a lot of free inventory space, and a lot of time. So let's just go ahead and uh, hit up the beach area down here, and we'll fish here for a little bit off this dock maybe, and then we'll also fish a little bit. Um, 
towards uh, the other beach over there. It's kind of hard to see the fish. I don't know if it's like an easier way to see them or not. But we have like no ocean fish. This was going to be all new fish. All new fish, boys. And can we like place fish in here? Huh. Maybe if we get some fish, we can try to place them in there. But I feel like that's... Oh, there's a fish there. Let me try to get that fish. Uh, you know you want a fish. My first ocean fish. What's it going to be? Dead gummit. <laughs> I could have swore it took it down. All right. And here's a fish with a fin. Is this a shark? Dude, our first fish, ocean fish, is going to be a shark, man. Ain't no way. Oh, I'm scared. All right. All right. All right. Come on. He took. He didn't take the bait like he ran away from the bait for a little bit. Come on. We got to get this one. We can't let it slip. He's moving too much. All right. We got this. Oh, my lord, dude. I wasn't expecting that. But that's pretty cool that we know sharks can come out right now. Hopefully, we can find more of those. Oh, here's a big old fatty fish. All right, big old fatty fish. Come on. I bet sharks are pretty good money, probably. There we go. Hey, a sea bass. Sweet. Our first uh, ocean fish. There we go. And we have this little smaller ocean fish here. Oh my, that was an instant bite, dude. Instant bite. Not much you can do about that. There's a little fish here on the side of the dock. We'll try to get him. Okay, he's going for it. That gummit. How am I so bad at fishing? I'll get better, boys. There we go. There we go. What's it gonna be? Hey, that's a sick looking fish. Zebra turkey fish. Okay. So we've got two new fish. The majority of the fish we catch in the ocean are going to be new fish, so. Understandable. Understandable. Did the fish ever spawn out here? Alright, so can we put fish inside this thing? Nope. Huh. I wonder what it's used for then. Like, what was it for? There's another fish. Okay, we got this. Got him. Another one of these fish, but that's fine. The more we do stuff, the more we can. Oh, there's a more fish right there. We're gonna catch until we have a full inventory. Once we get a full inventory, we're gonna go to the museum, donate what we can. Then we're gonna sell everything at retail. That gummit. Then we're gonna go to the other beach and fish there. Hey, a small one. This is a new fish for sure. I haven't caught any small fish yet. Gotcha. A little seahorse. Sweet. A seahorse. I mean, of course. <laughs> Alright. That's pretty cool that we got a seahorse, though, right? Hey, there's a fish. That's a, like a, not a small fish, but a, not a medium fish either, you know? It's a pretty good sized fish. And what's it gonna be? A mackerel. Horse mackerel. Alright, there we go. We're catching a lot of fish now. That's always good. It's always good to catch a lot of fish. And we have a few more inventory spaces open. We got nine inventory. So nine more fish. I wonder if we'll see another shark tonight. I can't believe I missed my first shark, dude. I thought I was going to get it. thought I was going to get it. But I wasn't even close, so. Serves me right. Alright, fish. 
literally went the opposite way of my bobber. Alright, let's see if we can get it. There you go. You know you- oh yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. Get him up. Really, man. Clownfish, baby. We got the whole crew now. Nemo's here. Got the whole crew. So many new fish. So many new fish. That's another big one. So I'm gonna stop going on the dock because it seems like the fish aren't really going onto the dock and stuff. Just gonna go for that. There you go. There you go. I feel, uh, I was about to say, I feel like it's too small to be a, a sea bass. But you never know. Alright, let's, uh, there's a big old fish. Now that's probably a sea bass. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? I have no idea. I'm such a, a mess upper, dude, at fishing. I can't, I can't do this. I get too nervous when it comes to this stuff. But I can do it. I just need to calm down, dude. So I just need to calm down. Alright. So we're gonna have a few fish to sell for sure. Another one. A squid. Sick. So we're gonna have a, a lot more fish to put in that little uh, pre the saltwater exhibit for sure. That uh, exhibit's gonna be booming now. And the more stuff we have in there, the more people are going to, like, come to visit the museum and stuff. Alright. And there we go. Good chow, boys. Good chow. Get it, fish. There you go. There you go. By the end of this, I should be, like, a pro fisher. And then whenever the new Animal Crossing game comes out, I should be, like, super good at fishing. How many more spaces we got left? We've got... Let's say six spaces left. Five spaces. Five more fish, boys. Five more. And there's some little bitty ones. Little bitties. Who's gonna take the bait? Oh, there we go. We got one of them. Got one, and it's another clownfish. I might actually keep this one. I don't know. We need a little fish to put in our house. A little Nemo. Do, 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 do. Yeah. All right. Catch out. There, there's a slender looking fish. We'll catch him. Here, little slender fish. Take the bobber, dude. Yeah. I'm so good at fishing. I'm so good at fishing. Here's the same size fish. Possibly the same fish. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right. Please take the bait. I just scared away an even bigger fish. That sucks. Um, but here we go. We got a squid. Sick. All right. I wish we could find uh, coconuts. Eventually they'll wash up on the shore, but it's taking a while, you know? Okay, slender fish. Here you go. Attempt number two on little slender fish here. Hopefully it's a flounder. I hope it's a flounder. <clears throat> so there's a lot of fish um, that are capped off by the seasons. They have different seasons they come out and stuff. So you won't see a lot of fish. Um, I think summertime has the most fish though, so we're good on that. Okay. I don't want to catch that fish. We only got three spots left. Let's see if we can find a, a shark. Okay, here's a big one. I'll catch this. I think these are usually just sea bass, though, you know? Okay, be calm, be calm, be calm. Be calm, be calm, be calm. Oh, why am I not calm, dude? I'm so bad at this. Is he going to see it? Yeah, he saw it. Okay. Just need more practice with the fish. Just need more practice with the fish. Just wait till it goes under. Once it goes under, that's when you can tell. Hey, a new fish. There we go. A butterfly fish. As mayor, welcome to my pockets. <laughs> All right, now I think we got enough room for two more fish. And that is correct. Two more fish for sure. All right. Anything over here? Uh, nah, it's going to be a no. I think there was one fish sitting over here, if I remember correctly. He's still sitting. 
And we'll catch him. Go ahead and, and get into the pockets. Like the little butterfly fish, whatever that fish was called. Alright, so there you go. We got him. Now we have enough room for one more fish. Alright, another squid. Alright, I wonder how much we can sell this stuff for. Let's. Our goal for tonight is to try and get the 120,000 bells that it's going to cost for that bridge. Because as soon as we can get that built, that's going to be a whole lot easier. And we can start getting other stuff built for the town too. Alright. And Kachel, last fish of the beach. This fish is kind of fat, but we'll catch him. I hope it's a puffer fish. Dude, there you go. There you go. Come on, be, be a puffer fish, please. Puffer fish time, baby. Okay, I thought I'd get away for a minute, but he's he's good. It's a dory fish. Sweet. Awesome. You caught a surgeon fish. Um, there we go. So we've got a whole inventory now of fish and a lot of new fish. And uh, quite a bit we can actually sell, so we'll go ahead and do this. Hey, what do you want, Ricky? Uh, this might seem a little weird, but can I ask you a question? What do you think of me? You're super nice, dude. What? You think I'm nice? Oh, wow. I had no idea people thought of me that way. I don't go around trying to be nice, I swear. I just try to be me. You're a good dude, man. You're a good dude. I want a slingshot so bad. Alright. It's time for Sprite. Alright, alright, alright. Let's do it. <clears throat> Donate into the museum. I've never seen a single fish over at the this pond here. I'm not sure if this fish even spawned there. But if they do, I will I will catch it. Okay. Hi. And here we go, blathers. We've got some pretty good stuff. We got some donations we want to do. Um, zebra turkey, one of those, one of these. I'll just, I'll just select everything. He can just take what he wants. Okay. 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 How many fish we left over with? We got left with mm, six fish. That's pretty good. Um, we'll go try to sell these at the retail place, see what kind of money we can get for ocean fish, and then we'll just start selling more ocean fish. Well, we're gonna go check the other beach out. Haven't been there yet. Let's check out this thing here. Like, what is this? Pewter Museum Exhibit Guide. Oh, uh, so it tells you everything that I've donated. The fish one is a lot bigger than anything else. We don't have any paintings at all. And we got a lot of bugs, too. We got about as many, we got a couple, we got a bit of dinosaurs, quite a bit of bugs. And it's starting to grow. It's starting to grow. It's going to take a while, um, but it's whatever. Okay. Next ocean, as soon as we uh, check out the prices on these things, because I don't even know how much this kind of stuff costs. I don't know what it's going to cost. Okay. What's the secret item for today? We need to check that out. Um... Venus comb shell. Hey, we can get some sh shells and sell them. That'd be good. Um, we'll do that before like it closes or something. I don't know how long I'm going to play for. I'm going to play for quite a bit. I expect to anyways. Alright. Alrighty then. Let's see here. I want to sell some stuff. Okay. What did you bring in? Some ocean fish. Uh, I don't know what the prices go for this, but let's see. Um, 2,000 bells. Alright. All right, so this is gonna be like our main source of income for a little bit. Um, there's not really a lot of ways to earn money in this game. Not really that many ways to earn money. I think fishing is the best way. If we had uh, other trees besides pears, we could grow those. And that would be a good way to earn some money. But uh, it's not looking like we're gonna be able to get anything very soon. Sometimes you get stuff in the mail. So Venus comb shells that we're looking for today. And we're also going to look for some fish while we're looking for the shells. Alright, cowrie shell. Sand dollar. So, some coral stuff. So, I think it's got to be shit like this. This is a Venus comb shell. There we go, Venus comb shell. Did I even see a single fish in the this, in this water? Is that a Venus comb shell? Hey, there we go. There we go. I don't think I even saw a single fish. There's a fish. 
Venus comb. All right, here we go. First fish of this beach. I'm so mad that I missed that shark. That could have been a shark, a well shark, a hammerhead, or one of those uh, ocean sunfish. That's what they're called. Dad gummit, dude. Oh, I'm so bad at fishing. All right. So let's uh, rack up an inventory on this beach here and see what we can find. But I don't ever see any. I don't see. I seen one fish so far. And I'm going to the entire beach here. Where are the fish? Oh, that's a sick butterfly. I gotta catch that. What kind of butterfly is that? An emperor butterfly. Okay. It's a new butterfly for the museum right there. Alright, let's keep looking for more fish. I don't see, like, any fish at all. Any fish, please? Oh, there's a small fish. Small fish. Here you go. Here's some bait. Come get the bait, please. And he went right for it. That's what I like to see. A fish with attitude. A Nemo. Sweet. A little Nemo. Okay, so we'll probably not be able to put... Um, for me, just getting 2,000 bells. That wasn't really a full inventory, but... Um, it's going to be hard to get that much money, probably. We're going to have to just do whatever. I think once we donate enough stuff to the museum, we'll be able to stop donating and start, like, making our own money. Hey, there's a big old fat fish right there. Alright, we're not going to miss this one. We're gonna actually going to catch it. This fish is going in the museum. Come on. Got it. Is it a sea, a sea bass? Too big. Aw, oh, sea bass are huge, dude. Well, I'll just catch them. Well, there we go. That's our biggest fish we've caught yet, for sure. Those things are huge. They are huge. Alright, here's another big fish. But it doesn't look as big as a sea bass. Maybe because it's at a weird angle. But we'll give it a try here. See if it even goes for the bait from right there. Oh, uh, I thought it was going to go for it, but it did. Why am I such a bad? Here's another one. I think red snappers are the same size as this. Um, red snapper, please. No, another sea bass. Another sea bass. All right, here we go. More fish, please. More fish. No, nah, no more fish. No more fish. All right. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. All right. Where is the fish? Where is the fish? Let me check something really quick on my phone. Oh, it is a 721 in this game right now. I'm going to put the stream up on my phone here so I can... Uh, watch it from that to make sure Yeah, make sure that the quality is looking good. All right, let's continue on I don't see any fish boys There's not very many fish Very little fish. Okay, there we go There we go. Come on There we go perfect and another one of these fish. That's pretty cool. Butterfly fish. Alright, so I'm thinking that maybe these ocean fish aren't worth that much money. It seems like the river fish are earning me a little bit more money when I was selling those. Um, we'll fish here for another inventory and then we'll go look in the river because we've still got to find an eel for Ricky. He wants to put one in his house, I think. Okay, he went for that. He went for that one. Alright, here we go. Dad gummy, I'm so bad at fishing on this game. Okay. Alright, here's a good sized fish. This one could be something cool, potentially. And there you go. Go for that little fishy. You'll like that one. You'll like that one. Ugh. I reel it in every time I get. I just think he's going under, man. I just think he's going under. The next fish I will do with my eyes closed. I'm gonna try to train myself to listen for the sound. But not with this big fish, because it could be something cool. I don't know if these are... This is like just the generic size for sea bass. 
but potentially this is not a sea bass. I'm hoping that it's not one. Is he gonna go for this? Yeah, he's gonna go for this. Okay. Gotcha. Yep, it's a sea bass. So, I don't think I've caught a new fish yet, have I? The only thing I've caught new was that butterfly, which that would probably sell for a lot of money, but I'm not gonna sell that. That's gotta go to the museum. If we can find a second one of those, that'd be sick. All right, I'm thinking that uh, we're not gonna be finding any that many fish. This fish, this beach is a worse than the other one for sure. I won't be uh, fishing here very often, but I'll check it once a day to sell the shells and to sell, see if there's any coconuts and stuff. Cause if we could just get like a steady stream of money from like just various things, like once a, like every day, pick the fruit off of the trees. Okay, bite that fish. Okay, no biting, I guess. No biting. Cause if we could, if we could just get like different trees, I think I think they're they're a lot more money. It's a hundred bells for native plants, maybe 200, 300 bells for non-natives, and that would increase the value. And then I don't, I don't know. It'd be a lot easier to make money that way. I think it's the best way to make money. All right, another seahorse. How many inventory spaces do we have left? We have four more spaces left. Let's go ahead and see if we can. Uh, let's go to the other beach really quick. I'm gonna see if I can find any of those Venus comb shells. If I see any like sharks or anything, I'm gonna stop and catch that though. All right, this beach was a flop. Flop beach, floppy beach. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a, there's the pitfall. There's always a daily pitfall, dude. They're so annoying too. I'm just gonna follow them. There's no point in digging them up because it's just a waste of inventory. I wonder, can we put a bridge down at the water? If we can connect the two beaches, I doubt we can do that. Yeah, that's gonna be a no. We cannot connect the two beaches. That would be sick though. Dude, that is a big fish. But I swear, it's probably just a sea bass. But I want it to be something else. Alright, buddy. Sea bass or not? It was a sea bass, of course. But you can't pass up on a huge fish like that. Sea bass might actually be worth some money. We don't know. We didn't get to sell one before, so we might have a bigger cash stack this time. And we don't. Have to, we only have. We actually have no new fish to donate to the museum, so we're gonna get a better idea of what ocean fish, what kind of money they can make. We only got to sell six ocean fish last time. There was an ocean fish there, but I'm looking for the big kahunas right now. Also looking for um, not big kahunas. I'm also looking for the Venus comb shells. Wherever those things are. And there we go. Another sea bass. So we have a, like a full inventory of sea bass nearly. Um, we have how many more inventory spaces do we have left? Two. All right. Let's go check really quick and see if we can find a Venus comb. None of these are Venus comb shells. None of them are. Yep. That's all the Venus comb shells. So let's just catch two more fish and be on our way. What are you, buddy? What kind of fish are you? There's always a lot of little fish in the ocean. I don't know, there's different months. I'm gonna have to look up a guide on like when fish are available, like what times and stuff, because different fish come out at different times. And if we're gonna catch as many as we can um, before uh, the new uh, Horizons game comes out, then we're gonna have to be doing a lot of fishing, boys. And there's another horse mackerel. I think those are okay money, actually. And they're a good looking fish. Okay. Anything else? Where's all the fish at, boys? I fished out the ocean. There's no more fish in the ocean. I don't want that little one. I want something else. Is there anything else in the ocean? Anything at all in the ocean? Seriously, where are the fish at? Okay, there's one there. And then there's not one here. There's not the one. Okay, that's a fish there. Um, We'll come back through and we'll catch those fish if we want to. Alright. 
Next fish I see, I'm gonna catch it, no matter what size it is. All right, let's get this. I messed up. Okay, next fish. All right, you're the candidate. Hopefully he will go for this. I don't think he will. There he goes. There he goes. He went right for it. And the final fish is a squid. Sweet. All right, let's go tell this stuff and then take that butterfly over to the museum. Cannot wait for that bridge. Cannot wait for that bridge. And we'll have a third bridge eventually right there. What are you guys talking about? Hey Snake, the bottom of your undershirt is showing again. Your stomach is going to get cold, so make sure you tuck your shirt into your pants. Uh, you sound like you said this before, Ricky. Like you've got three boys at home or something. Uh, you knucklehead. I certainly don't have any good-for-nothing boys. You know, kids who act like you. That's kind of mean. So you're saying it better if I was a girl instead? I suppose so. If I was going to have kids, I'd want to have an angel of a daughter to spoil. Wouldn't be so bad to hear her call me... Papa now and then. Hey, wait, are you even listening to what I'm saying? <laughs> okay, it's always weird to listen to what they're talking about and stuff. Because I always have funny stuff to say. Okay, let's go over to retail and check things out. And we've also got to check in um, the things. Yeah, he has his whole life planned out. And Mouchi... Um, Mouchy Act A C N L. Welcome to the stream. Welcome everybody. Mr. Codfish, glad to see you in the stream. It's been a while since I've had you in the stream. Thanks for the comment the other day. All right, so let's uh, all the fish that we've caught and the Venus comb shells. So we didn't get any new fish that time, um, but hopefully we can make some money. We did get a new butterfly. We're gonna donate to the museum. All right, uh, you'll start crunching the numbers later right away, since I'm paying premium for at least one of these items today. Okay, so. We're barely making any money off the ocean fish, it seems like. I think I make more money off of the river fish, for sure. Um, we'll fish one inventory of river fish and see how like, what the difference of price is. We even had three um, premium items there. Alright. Let's get it, boys. Uh, we can donate to the museum anytime. Let's just fish in the, in the river right now. Let's go ahead and get to it. Alright. What do we got here? Our first river fish of the day is not going for the bait. All right, river fish, let's get it. We should also write a letter. I think the mu is the post office closed already. The post office is probably already closed. If not, we should definitely write a letter um, to the new resident of the town, and maybe even give them a gift. I don't know. There we go, a black bass for our first river fish. Um. So, whoever is in the stream right now, are you guys ready for um, the new Animal Crossing game that's going to be coming out in March? You guys ready for New Horizons? If you are, what did you did you guys watch E3 and see the cool stuff coming out? Uh, okay, there's no fish here. Where are the fish? It seems like there's a lack of fish at the night time. Now I feel like night fishing would be better, you know? A little bit of night fishing. Are you going to catch that, Barbara? Just look at it with your net. Oh, there's a fish there. We'll go ahead and catch that. Go ahead and catch this bad boy. And it was a carp. Nice, nice. Nice. Alright. Where are the fish hiding? We need to find that eel too. I wonder if we'll find one tonight. Um, hopefully we do. And we got some sub over in the chat. And it says, Mr. Coffee says, it actually looks pretty good. Yeah, it does. Hey, that's a koi. That's a new fish for sure. And Meowchi says, uh, I only wanted uh, a new Animal Crossing. <laughs> yeah, uh, Animal Crossing is so good. I love Animal Crossing. I played it for a long time. I'm so excited for the new game. I think I watched it really like 50 times already. Um, yeah, I've watched uh, a lot of people discussing it and talking about it and stuff. It just, it just gets me so pumped up. It looks like there's so much... You know, like in depth in the game, like there's so much stuff you can do. Uh, this fish here is big. It looks like the same size as that koi. These koi are worth a lot of money, I'm pretty sure. So if we can get another one of those to sell, that'd be sick. And we did, boys, we did. So there we go, koi fishing. That's the new meta for the game. 
that's the new meta. Yeah, so I'm gonna be, uh, Meowchi, if you're watching still, I'm gonna be uh, streaming, or not streaming, but new videos and streams of this daily um, until the game comes out. Except for on the weekends, so. No uploads on the weekends, I ain't feeling like that. Alright. Let's see here. Come on. There we go, there we go, there we go, come on. Take the bait, I'm so, mm. I reeled it in too early. All right, thank you for the viewership. Oh, but my plan is just to get as much done as I can in this game to see how far, and then in the last day before the game comes out, like do like a review episode and go by and like show everything we've done and how far we've come since we started. I think that'd be pretty cool. All right, there you go. There you go. Mmm, I get so nervous. All right, somebody with like a, a weird text name, a kind of Russian text, says, what are you playing, man? He says, play Pokemon. I don't feel like playing Pokemon right now. I feel like playing Animal Crossing, so I'm sorry. Maybe I'll play Pokemon. I'm definitely going to play, play Pokemon very soon. Uh, I have some streams planned for it. I have some streams planned very soon for Pokemon games. What's our inventory space looking like? We have a lot of space left. I'm trying to, to get... A full inventory of these river fish really quick. And these, I think these are called, this is like a lake or pond fish. They're usually a little different. Just a little bit though. Just a little bit. Alright, here we go. This is another koi. Another koi, please. Koi, koi, koi. Please bring me the koi. Okay, black bass. Black bass. I'll oh, get my way, snake. Oh, there's the eel we're looking for. Sweet. Now let's not mess this up. We have to catch this eel for Ricky. This is for you, Ricky. This is for you, buddy. We got it. We got it. Now let's go find Ricky, boys. Ricky's gonna love this. An eel. Alright. Uh, it's been raining in your town all day long. I always hate when that happens because then you can't really do anything and your guy, you gotta have the umbrella and stuff. And everybody's so. Usually somebody gets sick. It feels like somebody gets sick every time. Um, Ricky's house is this way, so. Maybe he's in his house now. He was out earlier, but I'm not sure he's in his house now. There's no way he's gonna be out all day long. He was just talking to Snake over there, so. Yeah, so we did just see him talking to Snake. What am I talking about? So I think he's probably over next to the town hall, but we'll go check there. So the point of the game. Um, I don't know how to pronounce that name, but the, the point of this game, Animal Crossing, if you don't know, is, um, there's Ricky, is to just, it goes by like real time, and you just play, dude, you just live. Okay. Ricky, I got this eel for you. I brought you some eel, dude. He was looking for this all day long, and I finally brought it to him. <clears throat> Hey, a bamboo flooring. I literally just sold my bamboo flooring earlier. Um, I guess we sell another one. We'll get this bamboo flooring. We'll send it in a letter to that guy. Um, what time does the... I'm going to my phone. I took a picture, a screenshot of all the stores and their times and stuff to see when they were closing so I could keep track of that kind of stuff. All right, so is the, is the post office closed? Does it have a post office? Does the post office ever close? I don't think it does, does it? Yeah, I think the post office is open 24-7, actually. So I don't know why I was thinking that. <clears throat> Let's just get a full inventory of fish. We have uh, seven more spaces. So seven more fish. And then we can uh, go to retail, sell what we got, and uh, then just do whatever, I guess. I've never played Slime Rancher before, but I've seen the game. It looks cool. Okay, here's another koi, please. Please be a koi. Alright, fish. Swim up the river and get this bobber. You know you want it, and you know you want to be a koi. We need the money. We need that cash. Alright, go for it, go for it, go for it, go for it, go for it. Dang it. We're going to miss the koi, boys. Come on, Koi, swim away, swim away, swim away, swim away. 
Oh, yes, we got it. We got it. We got it. Oh, he was swimming back into it. Dad, dad come it. But I think we got a new fish, though. A cherry salmon. No, I think that's not a new fish. I think I've already donated one of those, but we'll see. I'll definitely, um... I'll definitely do whatever. <clears throat> but yeah, Slime Rancher. I have not really played that game before, so... I don't have an opinion on it, but I've seen videos and stuff. It looks cool. I would potentially play it one day, probably. Babara, what's up, my girl? So, do you believe in UFOs? Uh, yeah, of course. Oh, for sure. I spotted them after midnight. The UFOs come out late. Oranges. Unidentified oranges all over my floor. What? <laughs> I wish we had oranges in this town. That'd be cool. Fun fact, the first ever the first ever time I ever played Animal Crossing on the GameCube, I had pears, which is my town fruit right now. I had pears in that town as well. So, it's like, whatever, you know? Alright. Here's another fish. Okay, so it's a free game. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna check it out for sure. Okay, here's a smaller fish. We'll go ahead and catch it though. Oops. Ricky, don't you mess with this fishing flow. Cheer me on, Ricky. Cheer me on. There you go. So I think a villagers are next to you. What made you start playing New Leaf just now? Just the fact that New Horizons is coming out? Did you restart? Yeah, so I actually, um, I played New Leaf a long time ago, and I, I had a pretty good town. I, I didn't have a max out town. I had a, a pretty big house. I think I had an upstairs and then a side room. Um, and then I had all the shops in the main street, and then I had a few things, a lot of stuff built. Um, it was... It was a pretty big town, pretty big save. I actually restarted just for this series, um, just so I can get the feel back for playing Animal Crossing uh, after watching the trailer. Because the New Horizon just got me so excited, I wanted to play Animal Crossing again, so here I am playing again. Back on the, back on the ground. Okay. Back on the ground with my Animal Crossing friends. My Animal Crossing friends. Yeah, I'm also ready for the new Pokemon game. I love when those are this. I'm just gonna have so much to play, in, like this next summer or whatever. I'll have Sword and Shield to play. I'll have uh, Animal Crossing to play. There's a lot of there's a lot of cool games for the Dead Gummit. There's a lot of cool games coming out for the Switch, and I'm excited. Hey, what kind of fruit do you have in your town, Miyachi? Do you have any cool fruits? My favorite villager is this. The snake guy. He's my favorite one so far. This looks the coolest. Oh, you have all the fruits? That's pretty cool. Um, oh yeah, I need to tell him I handed that package over. Well. <laughs> Do you think you can help me get the fruit? Because I'm looking for some fruits. Alright. Oh, so your town is maxed out. I plan on getting this town as maxed out as I can get it before. Okay, we got three more spots left. Three more fish to catch. Then we'll head over to retail and sell these bad boys. Yes, I will definitely play the new game. Uh, Russian name, dude. So I'm, I'm super excited. I have a lot of ideas for new videos for the Pokemon game. I plan on making hundreds of videos for Sword and Shield. So if you're excited for that game and you want to see more content of Pokemon by me, then you'll be ready for that stuff. I'll be uploading those daily, like maybe twice a day. Alright, fish. Bite this. I haven't caught much trash today. I caught that one tire earlier. Dadgummit. Caught that tire, and then that was it. All right, where is the fish that I'm looking for? I still can't believe I missed that shark earlier. I wanted that shark so bad. Dun, dun, dun. 
Yeah. This music is just so relaxing. I love playing this game. Alright. Next fish. Here we go. Next fish. Mouchy, how are you going to get the fruit to me? Are we going to visit towns? Alright. There we go. Another cherry salmon. I thought those are pretty good money, too. Oh, you're very close to the end of Slime Ranch. That's pretty cool. This fish is huge. So we go fat fish here, dude. Let's get it. Oh my lord, I let it go. Every time I see a big fat fish like that, I always let it go every time. They call me the worst fisherman for sure. That was such a quick bite right there. Such a quick bite. And a dace. That's a new fish, I think. Is that a new fish? Alright, I think we have one more space left for a fish. Come on, can we get a big fat fish? Nope, I got this little one here. Could be worse though. Could be worse. There we go. Next fish, please. And it was a can. Just talking about the trash and stuff, and then we end up getting a can. Alright, let's head over to the museum really quick. In this game, well, you just live life, dude. You pay off, your, you buy a house, you buy some land, pay it off. You're actually the mayor of the town, so you get to, like, build the town up and stuff. And you help, like, catch fish and find fossils and catch bugs and stuff, make money. It's just a game that you play and, and like, live like you're in real life. That's all you do, really. All right, Blathers, here we go. All right, let's go ahead. Oh, I, did, I don't mean to do that. It, you, it's not really, it's on the DS, Nintendo DS. This one, this version is, um, but you can play with your friends. Yeah. Okay, let's see what we have to donate here. We have two things to donate, and there we go. All right, there we go. Meowchi, can you come to my town and bring me some fruits? There we go. Please enjoy the rest of the visit. If you do come, um, I do want you to, you can bring fruits and stuff. Just don't, um, bring like a lot of money or anything. Cause I kind of want to like take the series slow and not have like a whole bunch of money. All right. Let's take this stuff over to retail. I mean, I'm sure you understand that I kind of want to work for the stuff, you know? But I do appreciate the fruit because it's hard to get fruit without having friends. You gotta have people that have the game too. So I appreciate everything that you can give me. Or the fruit anyways. Alright, Reese. We're here and we got some fruit for you. I wanted to sell. Well, not fruit, we got some uh, fish for you. So hopefully you'll like this fish. We also got a bamboo flooring. Uh, uh, yeah, we're gonna sell the bamboo flooring and, and get rid of that can. I think I'm gonna buy that scarecrow at Tom Nook's store. On this live stream, I'm only gonna play this game, so sorry if they were looking for something else. Um, 7,000, yeah, so I think this, that the river fish are definitely better than the ocean fish right now. Your code is 1607. Now, do I have to go to back to the home screen to add you really quick? All right, I'll pop it up on the screen, probably. Let me, I think I need to save my game then. Is that what I gotta do? I'm just going to go ahead and save the game really quick then. I'll save and continue. Just to make sure nothing happens, you know? Alright. Alright. Let's go add some friends. Um, I guess we go... No, it's not Meverse. It's not Internet Browser. It is Friends List. There we go. There we go. Register a friend. Let me go ahead and add you. Um, let's go for internet. Friend code is one six zero seven two two three four seven six zero oh, three. Okay, there we go. Awesome. And uh, what should I name you? What kind of name? Meowchi. I'll put Meowchi. 
Meow Chi, there we go. There we go. Meow Chi has been registered as a friend. Sweet. Um, now, how do I... Okay, here's mine, I guess. That's my friend code? All right. Go ahead and add me and let me know once you have me added. So we can get those fruits. I need those fruits, baby. Yeah, it's Brock from Pokemon. <laughs> Alright, Miyachi has been fully registered. Alright, so I guess that means that you are also online. Sweet. Alright, now we can go back to Animal Crossing. Sweet. Alright. Now, how do you come here? Do you just uh, ride the train or do I have to invite you? We have some people coming, so I need you to act your best. Alright? I wanna chat. Okay. Alright, um, let me know whenever you're done gathering your stuff, and then I will send you an invite. Alright. Let's go, uh, get some stuff. I need to send a letter. Um, to the people or whatever. To the new resident in town. I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of my rod really quick. Okay, I'm going to buy that scarecrow and also some more paper. Okay, a scarecrow, yes. The price is full. Okay, that's a pretty cheap price. I'll take that for sure. And I think the deer would like that. What time will this stream end? I've only been live for an hour and ten minutes or something like that. So it'll probably be a little bit longer. Uh, an hour and 17 minutes. So I'll probably, I'll probably stream for another hour or two. Or probably two hours. Because um, I do want to get a lot done in today's episode. I want to get a little bit of money. And uh, if she brings those trees over, then I want to um, get those, those, uh, those new fruits and stuff planted. Alright. Let's do this. we got to write a letter to our new friend, Deirdre. Oh, Deirdre. Okay, okay, all right. Okay, let's do this. Go ahead, write a letter. Whoops, did not mean to write it to future me. Let's go ahead and quit this letter. I'll stop. Okay, write a letter to Deirdre. There we go. Okay, welcome to. Uh, pewter. And I'm gonna go over here for the symbol. Hope you have a great life here, it's what I'm gonna say. Oops. All right, that's probably a good enough letter. I don't want to do anything too long. Yep, now we're going to play together. I'm going to go ahead and uh, send this letter to the new Dear Dre guy. And then Meowchi is going to come over and bring us some nice stuff. All right, let's go ahead and send this mail. All right, sure thing. Who do you want to send your mail to? I want to send it to a person in Pewter. Okay, just drop anything you want to there in the red box. Sweet. Okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. All right, I'll send this mail off at once. Thanks for choosing Pewter Post Office. Thank you. Thank you for being open 24-7. All right. Um, there is one thing I want to check. Nook Homes, sometimes they have really cool, like, roofs and stuff to put on your house. And that would be cool to have some cool roofs and stuff for your house, you know? Some cool roof, cool sidewalks, cool door. Welcome, welcome. Cole, you have the most excellent sense of timing. Allow me to... This is the Happy Home Academy Special Advisor, Lyle. He's going to start coming out there on a daily basis to offer advice on the building for the wonderful. Okay, whatever. Okay, hey, nice to meet you. I'm Lyle, the Happy Home Academy. Um, I'm Pewter Area Manager. Bang, right. You're the mayor uh, of this burg. Lucky me. You got the house and Pewter. Congrats. You're good people. Here's the deal. The Skinny Happy Room Academy was just rooms. Now... 
not just one room. No, we went big, bang, the whole house. We researched day and night. We're the experts. Here's the truth. Happy homes make feel... Alright, so... Um... Alright, I don't really want to talk to you. Well, you heard what he said. If you have any questions about putting together rooms or whatever, yeah. Alright, so let's see what you've got, Tom Nook. Anything interesting today? I like this. How much for this? Alright, we'll go ahead and buy that because... Um, that would look good around our house instead of the fence. Hedges are way better looking. Okay, thanks much. All right, there we go. Just drop three K bells on that thing. All right. Okay. There's also secret items. What is this? Take an ID photo for 500. Might as well. We actually don't have an ID photo or whatever. I don't know what it's used for. Haven't played this game in a long time, so. Okay, ready, cheat. Okay, I didn't know the stream canceled there. The stream must have did something weird. All right, but we're back. <clears throat> I hear somebody has fleas. Who is it? There we go. I got the flea off of you. All right. All right. Did you just pick a flea off me? I'm so embarrassed. Yeah, that's fine. It's fine. Meowchi, are you ready to come over? Or are you still waiting a little bit? All right, so I guess, do I go to the, the little thing up here and invite? I guess I can blow one up here. All right. Yeah, let's go ahead and use the station. Okay, first things first. I'll need to check your town pass card. Okay, let's, we just did that picture. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, then nice picture by the way. You're quite a looker. <laughs> Thanks you for thank you, Porter. Thank you very much. All right. I'm guessing Isabel must have forgot to tell people she can kind of be distracted at times. So anyway, here's your town pass card back. Okay. Okay, you want to show me your TPC from now on? Memory is good. Okay. Um, let's invite friends here. Okay. From a faraway town. Alright. Wait, what did that say? What did that say? I have to change the online settings. Um... I'll change some settings really quick. Parental content is required to use any features that allow sharing of personal data. Please refer to the child online privacy, privacy protection restriction. This can be located in system settings under parental controls. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and save my game again really quick just to make sure it doesn't do anything. Alright, then we'll go check the settings and then we'll change those really quick so people can come over. Alright. Let's see if we can find that settings really quick. Okay. There were settings, I missed it. There it is again. Okay, so system settings. Is it system? I guess it's system, I don't know. All right, we'll go to system settings here and check it out. And we'll figure out the parental lock or whatever. Parental controls. Yes. Next. Okay. I'll just make out us use some random numbers here. And if you ever get a hold of it. Okay. Alright. This is taking forever. I don't want to register an email address. Okay. What is locked? Okay, child privacy. Okay. There we go. Do not restrict. Got it. Okay. That should have done it. So 
now we should be able to um, do whatever. My DS is resetting really quick. Hold on. Uh, I've had I had a purple DS, and that's one I have forever. But then when Pokemon um, Sun and Moon came out, I wanted to make videos on it, so I decided to get a new 3DS. And um, I decided to get a new 3DS, so that way I could... Uh, whatever it's called. Oh, yeah, so I could get a capture card built into it and record these kind of stuff right here so I could like stream and do stuff. All right, Ezbel, let's go ahead and go on in. All right, I'm gonna scoot up to my screen a little more. Hey, excuse me. Uh, mind if I bend your ear for a bit? What is this? Oh, uh, it's Rossetti. Let's see. Uh, all right, I should introduce myself. Oh no. Oh no. I didn't save and quit. I had no choice. I did save, but I didn't save it. I saved and I did the save and continue thing. I did the save and continue. Um, you gotta, I want you to quit. But I gotta listen to this guy talk the entire time and it's so annoying. It sucks so much. Okay, Rossetti, thanks a lot. Okay. We're good, Isabel. We're good. Okay. Let's get over there. So my town right now is just getting started. Um, yeah, I'm trying to build a bridge right here. So I'll be doing that. No, that was not an enemy. That's just a guy that wants you to save your game. So he's making sure that you save and stuff. So the bridge is so far away. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and make it up there. So my flag is a Malotic, so you guys can see that. So this game, I do have Pokemon stuff in this game. So my flag is a Malotic, and my uh, town tune is the Twin Leaf from Diamond and Pearl, the first town there. It's the it's the song from that. So I do have Pokemon stuff in this Animal Crossing playthrough, kinda. Okay, uh, let's invite a guest in. All right, would you like to visit a guest from nearby? Far away town. I, ugh, I did it. It's making me do it again. I guess it didn't save or something. I, I'm gonna have to save and quit, boys. I'm gonna, this is taking forever. Sorry. It's not letting me do it. Okay. Oh. There we go. There we go. Parental settings, let's get it. Do not restrict. Okay, I clicked done. I clicked back last time. I should have clicked done. All right. So there we go. Hopefully this time it works. It should have worked for sure this time. I was just making so many mistakes. This is taking forever, but we've got this. Okay, what did you say? Please say where all the gym is. What gym? What gym are you talking about? Oh, in Pokemon Planet Town, Pallet Town. What are you talking about? All the gym. I don't understand what you're asking. Oh. Okay, but we're back. We just left for like five seconds, but we are back. Okay, let's get it. The gym leader, which there's no gym leader in Pallet Town. Pallet Town is the first town you start out in. Okay. We did it. Now we can actually invite people over. Alright. I 
Let's get over to the place. Let's get over to the place. Yeah, I really need a new bridge. I'm building it. I'm currently building the new bridge right by my house so I can get to the new places. Oh, places faster. Okay, far away town. Alright, you can help donate for the bridge if you want. Saving. Do not touch the power. Alright, finally. Here we go. Connecting to the internet. Eek, eek. Sorry to keep you waiting. Let's open the gate. Okay. I guess it's open. Okay. Okay, you can check the TVC by doing that if you have visitors. Okay. Okay. Alright, now let's jump in front of the tracks. Alright. I'll be waiting. I'll be waiting for you. I'll be waiting for you. So glad we caught a flea. <laughs> Good old flea, dude. Hey, it looks like someone's here. Someone new is coming to the town. It's good old Meowchi. Saving, do not touch. The game is saving before you come and destroy the town. <laughs> All right, let's do this. All right. You can't find the seven and eight gem lead. I made a playthrough, so you should be able to find it. Go watch my Pokemon Planet playthrough if you're in the Kanto region. Um, I don't know what region you're in. What, which the Elite Four you've defeated. Alright, here comes the train, boys. And welcome. Good old Meowchi. Welcome here. Rebecca from Meowchi. Your, your town was named Meowchi, too. That's pretty cool. Alright, Rebecca, let's, let's get to going. Let's get to go. Oh, golden water can. Yeah. Here. Oh, yes. Apples. Bananas. Oranges. We have it all. We have so many fruits. We have so many fruits. I didn't even know there was this many fruits. Now we have them all. And there's nothing you can do about it. And a sick hat. And also, a little bit of cash. Alright, well, we'll donate this to the... Can you donate to the thing? We'll donate that thing. You topped. I can also top too. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we'll take this money and we'll put it into the bridge. Alright. So we can finally have a bridge. Alright. We're here to donate, little Lloyd. Alright. The cobblestone bridge is 128,000. Alright, we're, we're gonna probably get that tonight. Alright, Rebecca, you gonna head out? Thank you for stopping by. Thank you so much. Thank you. I wish I had something cool I could give you, but... Thank you for staying and uh, bringing the fruits and stuff. It was cool. All right. <clears throat> Looks like someone's leaving. All right, there we go. Yes, 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 yes. Rebecca from Yachi is going home. I love the crown. It's so cool. I didn't even check out the hat you gave me. I, I gotta look at that. Bye, Rebecca. All right. Now let's see what else we've got going on here. Saving. Do not touch. All right. Now let's go get... Um, I put it all in a playlist. So if you're looking for the Pokemon Planet playlist, um, I think there's like a Kanto, a full candle. I think it's on the front page of my channel. So just go look there. Like episode 11 or I don't know. Look at the video before them. For sure, Meowchi. Thank you so much. Hopefully I can see you on the stream again. Okay. 
we'll worry about um, planting these fruits soon. But first, we're going to check out this hat. Oh, sick. A Viking helmet. What? Yeah. Now nah, look awesome. Don't want to do something else with them. I think for now, I'll just plant them randomly. And, um, and then in the future, if I need to, like, landscape and stuff, um, I'll just... Uh, rearrange, I'll get an axe or whatever. Very one. There we go. An apple tree there. I'll try to keep these things close together to each other. Plant another apple tree here. There we go. And there we go. Let's head on down to the beach. I'm really excited to plant these coconuts because I always think it's so cool when you have palm trees. When I first played, uh, Animal Crossing Wild World on the the DS, the original DS. I thought it was so cool when I first got my uh, um, whatever my coconuts washed up on the shore and I planted some trees. I thought it was so cool. All right, um, let's plant a tree here. Coconut burial one. There we go. Are banana trees, are they also like palm trees? Do they also get planted on the beach? I don't think I ever planted banana trees in my game before. Do you know if they also go on the beach? Uh, Meowchi? I'll plant one on the beach and see what happens. Let's see if it looks like, if it looks like a palm tree, then I'm guessing it's good. Okay, so yeah, bananas can be planted on the beach. There we go. There's another banana. And we have another coconut to plant too. Can I plant this coconut like up here somewhere? No, I don't have any more coconuts to plant. I don't know what I was thinking. Durians? No. Alright. Now, that's all the stuff planted. The bananas and uh, whatever. We have some more stuff we can plant, though. We'll go plant these up here. Might as well get them going as fast as we can, right? Uh, here's one persimmon. Put that one there. No, that's too close to the, to the water over there. And here we go. Plant another persimmon. Sweet. There's all the persimmon trees planted. Okay, we have this wide open space here. It looks good for trees. Okay, we'll plant... Uh, we'll plant all the mangoes here. Do mangoes go on the ocean beach? No, mangoes can. It's definitely a... Yeah, it's definitely not a beach tree for sure. Okay. Another mango. Boom. There we go. And we will also plant a mango here. Sweet. Bury that. We're going to have so many stuff. I want to cut down some regular trees, though. These regular trees are just getting kind of annoying. And we'll bury that there. Boom. Okay, you found the video? Awesome. Glad you found it. And there we go. It looks like a good place to plant some stuff. I think it's about to start raining in the game. Oh, my favorite Pokemon is Malatic. I love Malatic. It's such a cool Pokemon. Perfect oranges. Those are all perfect oranges. Okay. I feel like we should sell those for some money to get the rest of the money for uh, the bridge over there. I don't want to plant any more pears. We'll plant these durians right here. Okay. 
Okay, one more durian to go. Then we have three peaches. Awesome. And bury one here. Boom. And then we'll bury one up here somewhere. And there we go. We buried all the stuff for now. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. There we go. Now let's see if we can find a few fish. Because I don't think these peaches are going to be enough to get us the money we need to finish off. What we're doing. Alright, fish. I need you to bot this bobber. I know you see it. I know you see it, Mr. Fish. Come on. Come on. Oh, I swear he looked at that, dude. Come on. Take a look at it. Take a look at it. Alright. Come on. He's got to see it this time. There we go. There we go. Gotcha. Gotcha, fish. There we go. The big old carp. Awesome. Okay. And anything else? Any big old fishes? Big old fish. Looking for a big old fish. Got my eyes closed, boys. I hear it going drum tapping. Eh? Yep, I did it with my eyes closed. Perfect. And we got ourselves a bass. Sweet. A few more fish, then we'll just go turn these in. These are perfect. We'll get extra money for them. And then also, they're not native, so we'll get even more extra money. I don't want to catch that fish. I think I saw a big one over at the pond. A big old fish over at the pond. Big old fish over at the pond. Big old fish over at the pond. We're looking for the biggest fish in the world. Mega fish. Oh yeah, that's a big one right there. Oh yeah. Okay. I will not get nervous this time, boys. I will not mess this fish up. This fish is going in the museum. Whether he wants to or not. Got him. Got him. What's he gonna be? Yes, it's a gar. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's what I like to see. Give me a big old gar, dude. You're going right. You're going right on over to the to the museum. We're gonna catch a few fish. You want to be a chef in in real life or in a video game? What do you want to be a chef of? What do you want to be a chef of, my dude? Oh, you want to be a real chef? That's pretty cool. How old are you? Are you, are you like going to chef school? Are you old enough for that, or are you still young? Because that'd be cool. I think cooking's really fun anyways. Is that an eel? Could have swore I saw an eel. Oh, you're only, you're only, you're young still. That's still cool. That's a good dream, dude. Don't give up on your dreams. I'm actually about to finish. I got one year left of college. And then... I'll be off. One year left of college, and uh, my major is in biology. So, hopefully, working with real plants and animals one day. That'd be cool. I've always liked plants and animals. There we go. Good job. 
All right, so I'm gonna head on over to, I guess. Okay, we got two, two pretty good sized fish here. We'll give them, a, we'll give them a capture. Okay, there's the one of them. It is a cherry salmon. Rainbow trout, actually. Okay, we'll get some good money this time. And here we go, another fish. I don't know what this one's going to be. Hopefully another expensive fish. I think the rainbow trout are usually pretty good priced. There you go. Right in front of him. Perfect cast. Perfect cast. And then I ruined it by reeling it in too early. That's what I do. Alright, are there any fish here? Nope, no fish. Alright, let's go ahead and go on. Hey Mitch, welcome to the stream. Just saw your text down there. Glad to see you. Glad to see you, my dude. Although I'm about to end the stream. I do appreciate you stopping by. I've not been playing Pokemon Planet in a long time, so I'm sorry about that, but I just, I'm not interested in Pokemon Planet at the moment, so hopefully you guys understand. We have an alligator gar and a flea to donate here. Okay, we'll go ahead and give you those. You can go ahead and take them. And then we're gonna go we're gonna go sell the stuff that we can get. Nothing. Okay. We're gonna go sell what we can. All right. Nook, knuckling, knucking tons. Check out that one area. Dude, you got the angel wings and the teddy ursa hat just like me. That is pretty cool. I actually like that. I've, I've been, I've had those wings for a long time. I wish I didn't color them the way I colored them though. I don't like the brown color. It looks so bad. All right, let's go ahead. We'll sell our fish here. These uh, perfect oranges, some pears, and this should be enough money. Hopefully, I think. Yeah, I think this. Hopefully, should be enough money. It is pretty cool looking. I need to get the I need to get the wings back white again. But I need some more dye for that. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, see how much money we owe on this dude over here. I think 8,000 should cover it. All right. Where's he at? There he is. Okay, our target fund is 1,000. Okay, we're gonna need more. 14,000 away. All right, so let's finish this up, boys. We need to get all the money. When's my next live stream? I'm not going to be live streaming Pokemon Planet for a long time, so if you're looking for a Pokemon Planet live stream, you're not going to be getting one, I'm sorry. I'm not interested in playing that game at the moment. And I, I do understand that people want to see that, but that's not what I'm looking for. That's not what I'm looking to play. I want to play games that I feel like playing. I plan on streaming uh, within the next two weeks. Um, I plan on streaming more Pokemon Let's Go. And this game, I do like streaming this game too. Uh, this is my first time streaming this game. I have been just uploading the videos, and I think the streams might be, might be a better idea to do those instead. Because then I can directly interact with you guys. And it's more fun that way, you know? Um, but yeah, I have some Pokemon. Let's go. Um, I have an idea for that. I'm going to start a new game on that. And uh, play through it on stream with you guys. There's another eel. I'll go ahead and get this eel and sell it. I think there's like another thing that has a slender body like an eel in this game, but it's not an eel. But I plan on streaming this game. I'm watching this game again tomorrow. So if you're wanting to come to the streams more often, then you can always um, you want to play it when it comes out on Xbox or something else. This game doesn't come out on Xbox. I don't know what game comes out on Xbox and get a Nintendo Switch. They're so much fun. 
I would play Nintendo Switch over Xbox any day. Cow Welder. Hey man, one of your old body TAs here. Glad you're still in bio. I need to message you when you get when we get close to friends on Pokemon Go. Yeah, for sure, dude. Um If I don't you have do you have me on I don't think you have me on Snapchat or anything, but you do have me uh, on here. You know my YouTube channel and stuff. So if you just go to my about page, my business email is on there. You can actually send an email to my business email. I check it daily so you can send stuff on there. And come on, can we get it? Okay, so you have me on Snap. All right. Then just send me a Snap whenever. Hey, another eel. Another eel. All right, let's keep fishing a little bit more. And oh, there's a big old, big old fish. All right, all right. Sweet. There we go, there we go. And a black bass, sweet. Sweet, all right, that's definitely, like, I don't, I don't, I don't know what happens when you become level four friends. Do you know, like, I don't understand. You're level 40, so you probably know, but I have no idea. Is there some cool stuff we unlock? I know you can get a medal. It's like part of doing that for getting a medal, but getting a little four friends is pretty pretty hard thing to do because people don't send gifts all the time. If you use an egg, you can get 200,000 experience. Oh. Okay, yeah, that's definitely worth that. That is worth that. I'll be using an egg then. <laughs> Oh yeah, Corey, you don't know, but um, I've actually started a Pokemon club on like a student organization on campus, and it has like a hundred members in it. It's pretty cool. A lot of Pokemon Go, a lot of Pokemon, just other Pokemon games, Pokemon trading card game, it's just everything. Mitch just said, how much does the game cost on Nintendo Switch? Uh, oh no. This game, when the new Animal Crossing comes out for Nintendo Switch, it'll probably be a full price game, about $60, so. It's just a regular price game. All right, we have a few more spaces open. A few more spaces open. There we go. There we go. And there's a fish. Dang, I wish I was still there. You visited the school back in December. That's pretty cool. When did, I, I, was, I left really early in December. I, got, I didn't go back. I went to my parents' house. I stayed there the entire time. Ooh, we're, my brother's coming down to go to school here next year. And we're moving to a new place. Um, moving to a new... We, got, actually, we actually just got a house down here. We rented a house out, and that's gonna be pretty sick. It's huge. It has a big backyard and everything. It's right next to the school. Hey, a new fish. I don't think I have a goldfish yet. Oh, you went to have lunch with Dr. Krausnick? That's pretty cool. So I don't have any. I finished all of my classes with Dr. Krausnick. I don't have any more. Chris is getting married next month. I haven't heard from Chris in forever. I used to have his phone number and stuff, but I had to get a new phone. And like my phone broke and I couldn't transfer any of the numbers or anything. So I lost like literally everything that I had. A lot of my contacts, people that I used to reach out to and talk to, they probably think I'm ghosting them super hard, but I can't contact them because I don't have any of their information. And there's nothing I can do about it. All right, here'll be the last fish I catch. Probably a bass, hopefully a koi, because those are some pretty good money usually. Yeah, so Chris, I remember them getting engaged and stuff, but yeah, so they're getting married. I wonder how far Chris is along with his master. How far are you along with your masters? Are you, are you got one more year left with your masters? And there we go. That was a that's a pretty good fish. Pretty good price on that fish. All right, um, let's let's head on up, boys. Let's head on up here. And donate that goldfish, I guess. Actually, let's uh, sell everything first. Whatever. 
Uh, you can send me his number sometime if you want. You're down to your last six months, but you're thinking about extending it. Why would you? I don't understand. Why would you extend it? Why would you extend it? All right. Let's go ahead and donate this new goldfish. Blathers, take this goldfish, stick it in your museum, and like it. All right. There you go, my dude. Have a good day with your goldfish. Okay. All right. Oh, you want to add your project. Just have a better... Okay, that makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah, so... I finished my bachelor's in the spring... Where I transferred from community college, um, it really messed me up. I didn't know how bad my stuff was messed up, but there was in that after I got my bachelor's in biology, that I was just gonna do whatever, like maybe even get a master's in something, not even biology, maybe business, I don't know. Yes, I can help you. I want to sell a few things, Reese. Okay. Uh, let's sell every little fish that I have. Hopefully we can get enough money. Come on, give us enough money, please. Please. Ah, uh, we're still short. Oh, man. After this, you're going to continue on to a PhD. I don't think I'll ever go to a PhD. I think that's just too much. And then having to continue the research after that. That's a lot. But Masters for sure. Well, I'll figure out my Masters later when I want to do more stuff. But I need to get this paid off. I need to get this debt paid off on this um, bridge I'm trying to build here. I think it's 14,000. One more inventory of fish. One more inventory of fish. Okay. Let's get it, boys. Let's get it. Meowchi, welcome back. I'm doing a little bit of fishing to finish off paying that bridge. Um, we have nearly enough to cover it. We're like 2,000 bells shy. I planted all the trees that you give me, so thank you so much for the fruit. I planted all that stuff in the around the village. I try to keep it in the same areas, like all the same trees together and stuff, but I planted a lot of trees. Um, planted a lot of them near my house. Okay, good job, fish. <laughs> you now teach, teach human anatomy physiology. A huge jump from teaching... Yeah, that's a, that's a huge jump. Do you know... Uh, do you know... Jerry Swallow, Jerry Swallows, from uh, he teaches he teaches A and P at Tech. Um, Thin Wind says, uh, "What is this game like? What do you do? This is Animal Crossing, and uh, what you do is it's basically just like a you do whatever. You know, you just kind of like live. You fish, you earn money, you pay off your debt, you buy a house, and stuff like that. It's just a fun game. You just uh, you just play." But yeah, Corey, do you, do you remember Jerry Swallows from the biology department? He teaches AMP. He also teaches cell bio. Yeah, you also knew Moran Perkle, but yeah, so um, Jerry, he actually played in the Pokemon uh, trading card game uh, Nationals when he was younger. He's our faculty advisor for the Pokemon club. And the Botany club is basically falling apart. There's like literally nobody in the Botany club, my dude. It's like me and Dallas and Lily and then like Emily just graduated and and then I don't know what some of the botany club because me, Lily, Dallas and uh, Hannah, I think we all graduate in the spring. I don't, I don't actually I don't, I don't think Hannah graduates in the spring. I don't know, but everybody graduates. And I don't think we're going to have any new members. We have like one new member that, that just comes. That club is dying, dude. The stream's kind of laggy. I'm sorry if the stream's kind of laggy. I don't, I don't, I'm sorry. I don't know why. There's a lot of people on the internet. I'm actually watching my own stream right now, and it doesn't seem kind of laggy to me. 
I think it's fine. Yeah, actually, yeah, yeah, I guess you're right. It is kind of laggy and stuff. Um, let me just go ahead and end the stream here because I don't like the way the lag looks and stuff. Um, so I hope that you guys enjoy this video. If you're watching on YouTube, guys, I'm going to ask you to subscribe. I thank you guys so much for watching you guys that are live with me. Um, I appreciate you guys for being here. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. It's funny that 90% of my viewers, I get hundreds of thousands of views every month, and 90% of you guys are not subscribed. Go ahead, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.